You're weird. I hope it's December and you're wearing that. It also has the good song. They have on this album this fire, and then later on they also have this fire. <laughs> really? Mm -hmm. They also have a song. Oh, the un oh, damn it! The unicorn is in the forest. Well, duh. I mean, I assume so, but. I guess we're heading back to the forest then? Yeah. I know the spirit ring also enables a special encounter, but I don't remember what. Probably a spirit. Yeah, but uh, I mean, it sounds like it'd also be in the forest, doesn't it? We can meet Satan in the desert. You're a desert. Oh. <laughs> Let's also go to the uh, riverside. Can we find anything? I don't know, but we'll talk to some interesting monsters. Let's make the monster. Let's go adventure. Spooky. Oh! <laughs> it's the glasses that really do it. <laughs> yeah, the visor, I guess, it's supposed to be. And that, that stepping it's doing. I said the lake to the south has shallows that let you cross the lake. Yep. Air, that face. <laughs> Cause yeah, you don't have a monster. You can't leave. You you can never leave. Oh, we're checking our Pokedex. I thought we were having a mon multiple monsters. At some point, but right now. Not. I, mean, I guess we both like the hanger a lot. The Griffin Ega? Owl Beard? Is that what it was called? The Owl Beard, with eyes full of sorrow and a heart that shuns fighting. His cry is even sometimes called the symbol of peace. So he's like the pacifist dragon. His name is Electra Eel. Why? This monster was a giant cat that grew arms and legs when it got hit by lightning. <laughs> 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 have the power to predict earthquakes. <coughs> well, that's a Japanese myth regarding cabbage. I think that was a cabbage guy by lightning, so it grew limbs. This is the other one. I Nicknamed the Red Dragon Knight, it, it once to be a great dragon, was bathed in its blood, and became an immortal spirit. It seems to have lost its body, though. <laughs> it just doesn't know where it went. Let's He's okay. I like his story. How he has Naga programming, but program broke. Hibis. Shanks. Mochi lips. <laughs> Evil fish. What? Yeah, he's pretty cool. What should we name him? Ah, Hello. I agree. We both like him. I'm gonna name him Kishin. Oh, okay. It fits. Although he's gonna die at one point, which is sad. He's a robot. Robots don't die. Hi, Mantis. <laughs>
<laughs> rumble, rumble. Which translate, and it translate as how many? Unicorn should be around here. The dragon encounters sign in the deforested area. <laughs> Pick up some gold. Was it wrong? <laughs> I love the voice acting. <laughs> We bought the unicorn flute, right? Oh, hi! What's that one called? Man Eater. It just doesn't say anything. We said hi and it left. I don't. This isn't working? It was very important that I did that. Did what? Create a monster loot right what? then and there. Why? Because if it's storming out and I lose power, oh. I have not saved since I started this. You had to do that so you could leave and save? Yeah. Because <laughs> the last thing I wanted was to have to go through all of the first two shelves of my CDs again for this. Understandable. <laughs> oh, it's Pseudo Dragon! Don't kill me. Kurosanai. Kurosanai. This is walks up. Hey, hey, don't kill me. Okay. <laughs> I want you to try doing that tomorrow at work and see what happens. Not killing people? No, telling people not to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> I think that would, con that would, con that would unnerve people. <laughs> Yeah, it's not showing up. Is this where you're supposed to use it? No, you don't use it. I think it... You don't use items. Oh, if I click this... Oh, what? Appearing while I'm not even walking! We have a save for yourself. It's dangerous to go alone. Okay. I mean, at pitch camp, I guess? Oh, use item. I tried out the unicorn flute. I guess I wasn't in the right area, though. I took a nap. Oh, uh, the horse, the unicorn appears at the end. Okay. Unicorn. Where'd you get that horn flute? <laughs> oh! What a cute monster! <laughs> my father gave this to me. It's true. This is the horn of one of my friends. Did your father kill a unicorn? Well, crap. No, if I remember correctly, he bought it from an old one, an odd wandering trader. Good. Thank you for telling them that. Is that true? Yeah. What did the trader look like? <laughs> He's gonna get ma killed, mauled by unicorns now. It's fine. My father said something about a short man with Eastern style clothes with a strong accent. So he's a short Eastern man. Could point out that he had like pointed ears and he was very fat and he was probably Wario secretly. <laughs> I see, it must be the Chinese orc. Well, that sounds racist. Anyway, it belongs to my friend. Could you please return it to me? Oh, that's dark. Let's. Why would we do that? Yeah, let's hand it over. Well, it's a precious thing that my father gave me. Oh, we got the achievement. Closure is magic. Yay! <laughs> um. Good, smart girl. As a reward, I'll increase some of your power. What did you increase? Of course, you knew the unicorn had disappeared. That was a strange experience. Oh, only by 50, huh? That was kind of underwhelming, but I guess it was cute. And you got an achievement for it. That is true. Closure is magic. 
So we still don't know if that's cool at all. The mysterious? Maybe that's what the spirit wings is used with. That would make sense. But we don't have one. <laughs> and the odds of us finding one on this run are very Almost unlikely. non-existent at this point. Our run's almost over. That's what I mean. Kitty. That is also a dog and a tiger. That would be a kitty. Oh, the adventure ended. So we just teleport home. Whoop. Oh, we're now going to the lakes. <laughs> Might as well wander around more. Just walk into the water. And all of them have the same music. This is my least favorite track. Fair. Oh, hey. What did we find? What are you doing here? Please don't kill me. Oh, okay. I mean, I didn't. You don't need I to. I won't. <laughs> we weren't planning on it in the first place. All right, three hundred money. <gasps> oh no, it's a pseudo dragon. Well, continue not killing him. He hates cold places. Well, then what are you doing where all this water is? Water typically drops the temperature of the area near it. <laughs> ah! Did you fall down a waterfall? Yes, I love face shakes. Something's around here. Oh no, it's kidnapper. Let's talk to him. <laughs> I love children. Weird, creepy guy. Oh no! Another one in the same place. Help! <laughs> <laughs> the kidnappers everywhere. There's a swarm of kidnappers right here. It's weird. It's bad and weird. I don't want to touch it. Oh, gold. No! I need to stay in the water where there are no kidnappers. <laughs> We're at the Villa of the Demon Lord. Whoa! Uh, hello! Dark probably wishes he were here to see that. That seems right up his alley, doesn't it? Did he say it was monstrous? Yes. I mean, I guess I kind of want to fight the kidnappers, but I can't. Traveling alone is dangerous for a girl. I think it's funny because this basically is what fairly harmless people were also saying. Who knew that the fray had a skeleton dragon in the er, CD? Their most famous CD, no less. Well, that's why it's famous. It's where you could get the skeleton dragon in Monster Rancher. Oh, Snakey is its name. <laughs> oh, is that name? <laughs> and the way you said it, Snakey. Those with spiritual wealth. You don't have a nose! And I love that. Look how nose look, look at their face! Stones like freeze, is it? Ah, uh, fair enough. Ah! I'm gonna ruin my clothes. Ah, oh, just another kidnapper. Why are there so many kidnappers around here? This is weird. And why are they so okay with just saying they love children like a creepy man? Because they don't realize it's creepy. That's the problem. Join the lake patrol. An enjoyable position surrounded by beautiful nature. And kidnappers. <laughs> An oddly large amount of kidnappers. Like, anything over one is an oddly large amount. I've ran into, like, eight of them. <laughs> Like, it, there is always a chance in some area that one kidnapper could exist. But it's very unusual for there to be more than one kidnapper. Hey, I have another black <coughs> scale. Hey, pseudo-dragons. Why are you so scared of me? I'm not even armed! <laughs> in fact, I'm the one making the reckless decision here. <laughs> I have no idea where I'm going. You're going over there. Oh, hi. It's a beetle, Nessie. That's weird. Someone's coming. Are you a kidnapper? It's dangerous under you. There are kidnappers everywhere. You should get out of here. <laughs> yeah, you should. They'll never fall for your mustache disguise. They know you're a kid. I'm a traveling merchant. Since I'm walking around with a lot of money, I'm quite worried. You should be! 
Why are you just telling random people that you're <laughs> walking around with a lot of money? Oh no, it's a kidnapper! He was a kidnap that merchant just a minute, second ago. It's dangerous to go alone for, if you're a oh, girl. This is Friday Night Boys. On the inside, it shows them all eating hamburgers. Oh no, another! Hey, dude, there's a kidnapper over there! See, they're all eating hamburgers. Gross. Hello! There's a kidnapper just like a few steps to the east. I said that kidnappers will sell children to exotic countries abroad. As slaves, of course. Really, I heard that they'll eat their eat they eat the people they kidnap. They don't really know what they do with them. Understandable. Oh, looks like we made it back. This place is messed up. I don't think so there's So remember, don't go to the lake, because it's full of kidnappers. <laughs> the lake is secretly the pool for kidnappers. Magical reputation went up by four because I talked to all those kidnappers. Oh no, I'm wearing this in the winter again! You were adventuring in the winter with that on. Which in English is you were adventuring in the winter with that on? In the water. But. Knowing Japanese games, it probably provided more high defense than you would have thought. 